Despite his campaign promises to get rid of the Iran nuclear deal, President Donald Trump is expected to certify Iran as compliant on their end of the agreement come Monday. Patrick Hostess writes, make Iran great again, huh? He's a military veteran. He says, Iranian bombs killed my friends in the Iraq war, but apparently my government doesn't give a damn. That's a veteran. That's not just a Twitterer who doesn't know what he's talking about. Never, ever, ever in my life have I seen any transaction so incompetently negotiated as our deal with Iran. It's one of the most incompetent contracts. Forget about deals from any standpoint, whether you look at real estate, whether you look at war, whether it's one of the most incompetently drawn contracts I've ever seen. We could have had a much better deal. We could have had a much stronger deal. We should have doubled up the sanctions, negotiated for strength. We don't get anything. We're getting nothing from this deal. And then you look at certain countries who are opposed to it. Now, all of a sudden, out of the blue, they come as an example, Saudi Arabia, they came back. Well, what are they getting? You know what we're giving them in terms of guarantees and weapons and money, probably? It's, it's absolutely a disgraceful deal. It's a bad deal. deal. There's no question it's an about embarrassment. it. It's an embarrassment to our country, and there's no way. Even, look, it's not the most important thing, but it's very important. Our prisoners should have been released before we even started That's talking right. to these people.